So a few weeks ago, I get an email from a fellow Atlantean named Billy. And Billy, he had a problem. I emailed Aaron uh, because I needed help. I'm six foot seven, kind of difficult to find clothes, and it's extremely difficult to find stylish clothes. Now you know I love a good style challenge, so I asked Billy to send me some pictures. I was intrigued. So I sent him some pictures. So I decided to make Billy an offer. I was going to take him shopping and help him for free. If I let him film it. What? It seemed like a fair trade. I need content. So I said yes. Now this is a special situation and required a special video and my normal production assistant wasn't going to do. So I called Christian to see if he'd be interested in filming the process. I said yes. So today we're making it happen. We're going shopping. We're getting his hair cut. By the end of today, Billy's going to have a few great outfits that he's going to be able to wear with confidence that's going to work, that's going to look incredible. Billy, are you excited? I am excited. Let's roll. Handshake. Christian, this is like Alpha M Power. <laughs> <laughs> One of the toughest things that I hear from guys who are larger, whether they're real tall, real real heavy, is the, the difficulty in finding clothes. What's your experience, Billy? Um, yeah, I've been pretty limited to where I can shop. Um, lately though, they've been putting in more and more clothes for you know, big and tall guys at and, normal stores. And that's it. Pretty much every department store now has a, a large, a big and tall section where before you only really were limited to, you know, big and tall specific and specialty stores. But now you can pretty much find larger sizes in a lot of these great retail establishments. It's pretty cool. One of the big issues with dressing a guy who's super tall, super big, is that the clothes are incredibly expensive, so much more expensive than they are for average size guys. And so that's another downside to shopping if you are of larger stature. All right, first stop, Dyer and Post the Salon. We're getting his grooming taken care of. We're also going and getting his hair cut. You ready, Billy? I'm ready. Let's do it. I'll probably give you a towel just so you can uh, hold it in there. All right, guys, so we're here, and Steven's going to take care of his hair. I'm thinking just tighten it up on the sides, texturize the top, give him a little Pete and Pedro action, play afterwards, style it up. Good? Alrighty, sounds good. Let's do it. Let's do it. gonna be awesome. Gonna take it tighter through the sides, give you a little texture, and then we're gonna style it up. Alright. Cool? And then after that I'm gonna I'm gonna groom this action because that is a little crazy. Yeah. Dude it's a chick magnet here. Yeah grow grow your hair out a little bit so it's gonna look more like Stevens. Right. Or like even or like, like where it's gonna be longer on here, it's gonna be faded tight through here. But you're gonna have to grow out this top a little bit. Cool? Right. Yeah. Don't be afraid to try a new hairstyle, gentlemen. So often we get stuck and fixated on a style. Every few years or even every year, it's a great idea to switch it up to keep things fresh and current. All right, he's all yours. Thanks, brother. All right, style time. Pete and Pedro. That's pretty cool. Let's groom. All right, so what I'm doing, I'm, I'm cutting down some of the length of his facial hair. When you don't have a lot of growth like he does, he's a little bit patchy. The shorter you keep it, the denser it looks. All right, man, you're finished. Let's roll. All right. 
All right, so phase one complete. Grooming looking great, the beard taken care of, hairstyle a little bit more modern, not a little, a lot more modern. Now we're going to find him some clothes. Come on guys, let's do it. You said you're 15 wide? Check this out. 15 wide, hush puppy, simple, black, totally stylish. You could also toss these on with a pair of jeans to dress them up. So, okay. let's give it a shot. Uh -huh. I would prefer it to be snug mm -hmm. and let your foot break it out as opposed okay. to the other one that was too big. Okay. But these are like perfect. These are great shoes for interviews. These are great for going out on a date. These are just simple. You need to invest in a shoe horn. <laughs> Stand up. How's it feel? Well, yeah, it's going to feel different than tennis shoes, but here's the deal. <laughs> these are more stylish. Tennis shoes are great. There's a time and a place, but these are a pair of shoes that you can wear that are more stylish that you can definitely dress up. Are you good with them? I'm good with them. I'd like say it. we lucked out. They're awesome. What about a belt? Do you have a black belt that I matches don't have this? Just a belt. No, I have well, what I have right now because I got it for nine bucks. So it's like a it's like a Velcro belt. It's really cool. Yeah. Sounds cool. Doesn't sound stylish. No, we no, gotta no. get you a belt. <laughs> <laughs> so something like this you could wear with jeans. You could wear with khakis, and it's going to match both in fec finish and texture. So are you good with this? Can we yeah. try it? Yeah. All right. Feels like a belt. Let me see. It feels like a belt. Good. Let me see where it is. It's perfect. Good. These are our better jeans over here. We got Levi's and then we've got our house brand, which is called True Nation. It's going to be your more eclectic type of jeans over here. Levi's. Mm -hmm. Levi's, Levi's. It's going to be a little roomier in the seat and the thigh and a little more tapered down at the bottom. Awesome. These relax are going to be relaxed straight the way through. They well, I'll tell you what, size. let's try. This is gonna look great. Let's give this a try. We'll take it from there. But yeah, you always have to try. Even if you've tried a similar brand, you need to try because everything is cut differently. Right. And cool. even the exact same model sometimes can be a yep. little plus or minus. So. Exactly. Follow me, I'll take you back to it. There you go, buddy. You're welcome. Yeah, these aren't necessarily my size, but these are a great stylish dark wash with a minimal distressing. So these definitely something to try on. All right, Billy, come on out. Let me see. They look great. How do they feel? I feel good. Great. I'd say they're keepers. What okay. do you think? I like them. You like them comfortable? Yeah. All right. I'm so excited. I found some shirts that you're going to love. All right. How do you feel about a little color? I like color. Yeah? Yeah. Excellent. Let's try this purple one. I think it's great. All right, I'm really digging this. The, the plaid, I think, is going to go great. We can get a lot of use out of this. Um, you've got it with jeans. You've got it with, um, with slacks. This is really a great option. I'm going to have them try this one on as well. Um, really, they have an amazing selection here. I haven't been into a casual male XL in a long time, and uh, I am blown away. They really do have some great stuff. So for you guys out there, hard to fit, come check it out. All right, Billy, let's see it. Dude, it's awesome. Purple totally works on you. The vertical stripes, love it. Slimming. And we put it with the black shoes, the black belt. This is a great going out outfit. You're going out to a nice dinner, a nice restaurant. Want to impress somebody? This is a great look. You like it? I like it. Cool. I got another one for you. All uh right. -huh. Come here, Billy. All right. So this one, this is a, a 4XL. This is definitely too big for you. You know, it, it's too blousey, okay? There's too much fabric. The other one was slimmer, it was a tighter cut. I got a black shirt that I think you're gonna love. It's not too baggy or anything? Uh, what size is that? Four. Is that a four? Mm -hmm. Do you have this in a three? Here, while he's checking that, here's right. a three farmer X. Shirt. What's that? So, hey, a farmer shirt. What are you talking about? <laughs> farmer shirt. <laughs> Come and look in this mirror. If you don't feel comfortable wearing something, you're not yeah. going to wear it. And so I mean, it's just good to know that I can pull off this. Yeah, like, I mean, three X size or uh, a normal length size won't totally lose the weight. Yeah, and honestly, I mean, this—if you're wearing this, I—I I would not absolutely think that there was anything wrong with that side. I would mm -hmm. think that it was good. But if you're not comfortable, you're not going to wear it. So let's look for a longer shirt for right now. I really like this. Um, you know, it's a gingham. 
pattern blue and white gingham it's very popular it's very stylish it's the oversized gingham and it's just a, a great look what do you uh, think with the two double pockets i think it's a great casual option okay. do you like it Let's see all right nice like me too perfect come on out let's see these jeans yeah how do they feel they look great yeah they feel good too a, it's a subtle difference. They're a little bit lighter. It's a different shade of blue, mm -hmm. but I really feel that for you, the darker jeans are going to be more versatile. Okay. Um, they're going to be, you know, more in style now. They're going to be fine in a few years, but you know, by that time, you'll probably wear them out. Okay. But I think for now, these are these are another great option for you. All right, sounds good. The black, it works with most everything, and and definitely the two shirts that we got. Boom. I really like it. It's almost like it's a zip cardigan, essentially. And so this is a great, because it's it's cold right now, winter, this is great. You can throw it over a t-shirt, like the, the Star Wars t-shirt even. It would look great underneath that. It works with jeans. It works with both casual, uh, both shirts that you got. I think it's a great addition. And it's got sassy fabric on the, co or on the shoulders. What do you think? Do you like it? Yeah, I like it. I think it's great. It's seasonal. It's all about layering, gentlemen. It's all about layering. I like it. That's cool. It's cool, right? Yeah. Did, did he just say cool? He just said it was cool. <laughs> great job. Yes. <laughs> I personally didn't think it was going to be this easy, gentlemen, but one-stop shopping. We got some great items, and uh, we're going to check out, see what the total damage is. But we got two pairs of jeans, two button-ups, we got a great zip-up, we got a belt, and we also got a great pair of shoes. Gentlemen, there you go. All right, see you next time. Take care, guys. All right, guys. Now let's go home, back to the studio. Put these outfits together and wrap this video up. All right, guys, we are back from our little mini makeover shopping experience and excursion with Billy, and I couldn't be more thrilled with the way that it turned out. The outfit just, I mean, it, it's just awesome. I mean, there, that's all I can say about it. How do you feel? I feel awesome. Do you? Oh, yeah. You can tell, gentlemen, he's smiling now. This is a great, sophisticated look. It is a total night and day transformation. The hair, the beard, Everything is working. Billy, I am so proud of you. Thank you so much, right, man. You're you. gonna do great. Gentlemen, this goes to show you, it doesn't matter how big or small you are, you can always look great. All right, this whole experience was, uh, was really awesome. Um, Aaron really knows his stuff. Uh, if I would've went out and did this on my own, I would not look even half as good as I do now. All right, this whole experience has been incredible. I feel amazing.